This video is sponsored by Minifix.me. Stick around for a special, exclusive discount code. Hi and welcome back to Cut the Crackle. Today we're going to be taking a look at two extra special custom minifigures from Minifigs.me based on the movie Demolition Man. And the reason why these are so special is because I requested these characters to be made and they are currently exclusive, available only to my viewers. If you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up, remember to subscribe and turn on notifications as well. In case you haven't seen it, Demolition Man is a 1993 science fiction action movie starring Sylvester Stallone and Wesley Snipes. Stallone plays John Spartan, a risk-taking police officer who has a reputation for causing destruction. Spartan is framed for sacrificing the lives of innocent hostages in his pursuit and capture of evil crime lord Simon Phoenix, played by Wesley Snipes, and they're both sentenced to be cryogenically frozen. Flash forward to 2032 and society has drastically changed. People don't touch each other anymore, everyone gets offended by everything, and there's no toilet paper. <laughs> he doesn't know how to use the three seashells. <laughs> After a complete balls up at the cryo prison, Phoenix escapes and the pacifist police force of the future prove no match for him. So, to bring this psychotic madman's rampage to an end, they awaken John Spartan to hunt him down. Or in other words, they send a maniac to catch a maniac. Demolition Man is one of my favourite popcorn action flicks of the 90s. So when the lovely people over at Minifigs.me asked me if I had any ideas for some new custom minifigures, I didn't have to think for long. Here we have two custom Lego minifigures of the two main characters, John Spartan and Simon Phoenix. Let's take a closer look at them. First up, we have John Spartan himself. And this minifigure is based on the uniform he wears in the opening sequence of the movie. You can see he has this great printing on his torso for his tactical vest with lots of different pouches and some spare magazine cartridges for his gun. He even has his name patch printed on his chest as well. That design continues onto his back and he also has some nice printing across his legs for the webbing straps and his military style boots. His face print is very nice too. I think they've subtly captured Sly's trademark lip curl perfectly without it being too distracting. He's also wearing this Blackberry piece, just like in the movie. It's never explicitly stated, but it's hinted that this is a callback to Spartan's military past, and he dons the berry again in the movie's final act for the climactic battle. It's such an iconic part of the character's look that I couldn't imagine this minifig without it. And he also comes with this really great custom piece from Brickforge for his handgun as well. It's almost a universally accepted fact that baddies tend to have more fun costumes, and that's certainly true here. This minifigure of Simon Phoenix is based on his outfit after he's broken out of the cryo prison, and I love how colourful this is. He has this bright orange vest under some denim dungarees. There's this really nice subtle stripe that goes all the way around the torso like a high-vis strip on his vest. Because, you know, without that, you might lose this guy in a crowd. I love all the detail on this with the stitches and pockets. That belt design on his hips blends the torso and leg prints together seamlessly. One thing I specifically requested for this minifigure was that he have different colour eyes. Part of Phoenix's unique appearance is his heterochromia, giving him one brown eye and one bright blue eye. I think it makes this figure so much more distinctive, especially as, generally speaking, Lego minifigures tend to just have plain black eyes. For his striking mohawk, minifigs.me have actually custom painted this existing Lego piece with this neon orange colour. It does mean that it won't be quite as durable, but these are more for display than play, 
I think this looks absolutely lit. Did I really just say that? I can't believe I just said that. Seeing as I personally requested these minifigures, I may be more than a little biased. But boy oh boy, do I love these minifigs. Like I said earlier, Demolition Man is one of my favourite 90s popcorn action flicks. But it's also really funny. Its depiction of a utopian future was always meant to be very satirical, but it's only got more relevant in recent years. These minifigures look fantastic, and I've already had so much fun putting these in different poses and spouting quotes from the movie. If you'd like to get your hands on these two minifigures, you can follow the link in the pinned comment below. These minifigs are currently exclusive only to my viewers, and if you use my new discount code 2021Craggle10, you'll get 10% off your order. Let me know what you think of these custom LEGO Demolition Man minifigures in the comments below. And while you're there, be a legend and hit that subscribe button along with notifications. And if you've done all that, well, you might as well give the video a thumbs up too. Go on, you know it makes sense. I'll see you next time. Be well.